Well, hello there, Leo. It looks like you're taking the right steps in order to protect and repair your energy. And good thing, because it'll be in time for when your dream person walks through the door. Let's dig in to see where this goes. Hello, everyone. Welcome in. This is a Leo Tarot reading. It is a general reading, usually between two energies. Let's take you to see what sort of theme we have for you today. As you can see, I am still traveling because my flight was canceled due to the storm. I oh, wanted to see if I could at least try to stay on time with videos this week, despite the curveballs of my schedule. So let's see how I do. Okay. Afterglow. Number 49, that reduces down to a four. Land gracefully. Ooh, okay. Ocean of emotion. Number 28, that goes to a 10 back down to one. Find a safe place to express your true feelings. Hmm. I hear that someone's getting help. Someone is getting help. Hmm. Someone has found whatever it is path they need to take in order to maintain personal internal stability, whether spiritual path, whether um, therapy, whatever it is. Um, there's someone who has found, they've found how to heal themselves, which is fantastic. Someone figured it out. Okay. Hmm. Show me what's going on with Leo, please. Show me what's going on with Leo. Okay. Three of Swords are underneath. Are we nursing a broken heart? Yep. Five of Cups. Six of Swords. Five of Pentacles. Magician Star Card of Aquarius. Page of Swords. Chariot Card of Cancer. Hmm. This does, yeah. This is a connection that had was moved on from. Read. This is you. This is them. This is the situation. So it's a situation that has changed. It is now lost. Okay. Noting that it was at one time it was probably turbulent in the end. This was a faded thing for this connection for this person to move on from this connection for you to move on from this connection. Okay. Um. Seeing like packing their car to leave. Hmm. It feels like you almost took your cues of the relationship from them directly. And I mean that like instead of coming to the conclusion entirely on your own, it's like you would kind of watch to see where they're at before making any decisions of any kind. Yeah, that looks like it hurt. That looks like it hurt. That's a lot of swords. Hmm. But it was something that was too heavy to carry, too heavy to sustain. So if this is seeking therapy after heartbreak, good idea. Very good idea. Show me the five of cups. I'd like to see the details of the situation. Show me the five of Cups, please. Judgment. Ten of cups, yep. Seven of wands, seven of cups. King of swords. Hmm. So here we have Aquarius energy with that king of swords. Judgment called on a ten of cups. Trying to push it off. Show me what the seven of cups was. Is it affair? Yep, three people. One person, yep. One person was blindsided. One person was blindsided. One person was blindsided. 
there could have been there there could have been forgiveness reconciliation to try again but it looks like that that's not going to fly committed person committed person single person it feels like this single person didn't know that they had a, that the person they were messing with had a spouse just to let you know whoever that's for okay so it was happy until it wasn't happy. And when it wasn't happy, judgment from the universe was called on it for it to begin to come to a close. And as that was avoided, one person probably pushed against that judgment call and the other person went out on their own to search for someone else instead of breaking up and then finding someone. Show me the Six of Swords for Leo, please. The Six of Swords. Knight of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Hanged Man, really trying to see it from their point of view, but it still remains, it still remains a shock to you that this person would secretly do this to you. So they cheated. Okay. Like, I love this person, I gave to this person, I don't understand why, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. All right, show me the magician. King of Wands, that's Leo energy. Nine of Swords, Emperor, card of Aries, Three of Pentacles. Okay, okay, if you're going to run a run, okay. If you're going to drive yourself crazy by thinking about who else have they done this with, just drop that. Drop it like a brick. You're going to make yourself go crazy if you go down that rabbit hole. Because I'm, I'm getting the insecure vibe of and who else. Uh-uh. Don't. Uh-uh. Don't go there. Do not go there. Okay. Because overall, I hear, feel, it feels like here there is the capability of starting new. But perhaps a little rougher around the edges. Okay, than before. It does feel like this situation caused an amount of stress. Because it's going from a dark beard to white hair here. It's like there's something there with these sleepless nights, insomnia kind of thing. That there's going to be phys marks of physical stress on the person, on the body. As getting to the point of starting new elsewhere. So just take care of yourself the best that you can. Okay. Show me the page of swords. Show me the page of swords. Page of wands. Temperance card of Sag. Eight of swords. Ace of swords. Okay. So this is the talking to each other. It doesn't look like arguing, surprisingly. The talking to each other back and forth. About what was not seen. About what w the things left unspoken. Okay. It's coming across. Um, finally talking about those things that could have led to this behavior. Not that that's a, that's still a choice they made. Right. Um, there's something about a truth here that doesn't want to be seen. There's something about a truth here that doesn't want to be seen about this connection. Like perhaps you knew this about them. Okay, or that this has happened before. Could be anything. Okay. Let's get into this person. Start with the Five of Pentacles, please. The Five of Pentacles. Four of Swords. Eight of Coins. Wheel. Three of Coins. So they know that they're the ones that has to go. 
It's like they're not putting even putting up a fight. They're not even putting up a fight. They they can take they can take what they've the fruits of whatever their labor was in this connection and move forward with their life elsewhere. They're very nonchalant about this, which is what's so surprising. Show me the star, please. Show me the star. Sun, Leo energy, Ace of Cups. Five of Cups. Page of Coins. Okay, show me what was learned. Mm, okay. You can't you can't use that to justify such actions though. Um, star card of Aquarius, Sun. That's Leo energy. Ace of Cups, Five of Cups, Page of Pentacles, King of Cups. That is um, Scorpio energy. Nine of Pentacles, Five of Coins. Okay. So in this process, this is something that this person learned about the truth of their own heart. There's yeah, there is remorse for what they did to you that hurt you um but something happened where this was they learned something about the truth of their own heart space of what it is that they need it doesn't mean what they did to you is okay it doesn't mean what they did to you and this is something they know show me the chariot please show me the chariot The Wheel, Magician, Two of Wands, Six of Swords. Yeah, this is very like nonchalant, packing and leaving, knowing this is over, knowing that they have to manifest something new and move forward on their own. So what was it that they, they learned about their own heart and all of this? There's something here where they learned about the truth about soul bonds. Um, if this was a person who never believed in soulmates before, there's still plenty of those people in the world. Those who have met them know, right? This could, It almost feels like this is a person who never believed in soulmates. And they just found someone who was compatible that they liked and said, okay, we're going to do this whole marriage thing. And then after that, they meet a soulmate. And it throws, com completely bowls them over. Because this is showing me a secret love kind of thing. Um, and, and, then, and then it becomes something that just consumes them. Yeah. Yeah, the truth is now that they understand what a match is, what the spark is, having the spark between two people. Hmm. Mm hmm. So again, it's not okay what they did because clearly you really cared about them. It's not okay what they did, but this feels like someone who never knew what a soulmate was and then they met one after marrying you, for example, or being in relationship with you. And that changed everything, including their actions. That's pretty tough. That's pretty tough. So what does Leo want going forward? You do want you, you do want the love that's worth taking a risk on. That is long term. Ooh, you want your Empress. There she is. There she is. So after all of this, you still want a commitment with the right person. And she's right there. Okay. Okay, then I'll head over to the extended and I'll look into this empress that you desire. Because clearly this this is not it. I'll see what's going on with them in their current energy, their near future, and the final outcome of the connection between you two in this lifetime. So, if you are interested in any of that information, along with messages from Spirit about the connection at this point in time, messages between you, as well as timing, Feel free to follow me by clicking the link in the description box below, and I will see you guys on over there.
ไป